Uh, let's try this again. Okay, here we are, sitting down, having story time after our bath. We had a nice day today. We um, went for a walk, sat on the patio, had lunch, went and saw the mailman outside, didn't we, Dylan, huh? And we took a bath, and now we have our pajamas on. And we're, oh, what happened to the lion? He's reading the book about the lion who got a thorn in his paw and nobody helped him. So he really loves his books. So. <laughs> Mm. Uh. Eh. Eh. Who helped the lion? Nobody would help him, huh? And we have pajama time. We have the castle. We have Dory. We have Elmo. We have all our favorite little books here. We have baby farm animals. Yeah. Baby farm animals. Huh, Dylan? We have, And show which book you have. You have the lion. The lion's paw. Yeah. So we have all our books here, and we're doing our story time right now to end our day. Huh. We had a very nice day. It was a nice day today, huh, Dylan? Yes, we did. See, he's reading the lion book. All about the lion's paw. And this is the baby farm animals. Who lives on the farm? What's your animals? The baby farm animals? Yeah, the animals live on the farm. Right, Dylan? Yeah. Okay, he's got the baby faces. He's got all these kinds of books. This is the special time of the day is when we sit down and read our books. Okay, we're going to say goodbye for now because we're going to go read a story. Well, which story would you read, like us to read first? Would you want to leave this on while Mike Mary reads a story? Which story do you want Mary to read? Huh? Do you want me to read? Um, let's see. Which one do you want Mary to read? Huh? Which book do you want Mary to read? So. The Lion's Paw? Okay, we're going to read The Lion's Paw. Okay, The Lion's Paw. Ow! roared the lion. There's a thorn in my paw. Who will take it out? Not I, said the solid rhinoceros. I am sharpening my pointed horn. And not I, said the coo. I am racing away from here. Not I, whispered the tall giraffe among the tip top leaves. And not I, said the bouncing baboon. I am having too much fun. Who will take the thorn out, asked the, the crane. Not I, said the hippopotamus. I'm cooling off in the mud. And not I, said the zebra. I'm kicking up my heels. And not I, said the bright-eyed monkey. I'm swinging by my tail. And not I, said the gorilla. I'm scratching away my fleas. And not I, said the elegant gazelle. I'm leaping across the field. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Well, will no one remove the, th the thorn called the abyss by the purple pool? Not I, said the slippery crocodile, smiling a hungry smile. Dylan, sit down. Listen, honey. He's standing up right now. Not I, said the trumpeting elephant. I'm taking a shower. Okay. And not I, said the spotted leopard. I'm slicking through the shade. Not I, said the Solomon buffalo. I'm too I much work it. to do. Who will help the lion, cried the ostrich running over the desert sand. Not I, said the sulky camel. I'm chewing my cur. Not I, said the swooping vulture. I'm busy hunting a meal. And not I, said the cheetah. I'm busy hunting too. I will, said the little mouse. And she did. The end. Hooray! Hi, did you like that story? Okay. Goodbye.